you must have seen in Elementor that whenever we take a button, it always goes under the existing button, but it never appears next to it. So let's go ahead and we can display two buttons horizontally next to each other. So this is the web page where I already have a button Y us. Now either we can duplicate this button or we can take a new button. So let's go ahead and we can duplicate this existing button. Now you can see over here, it automatically appears under this existing button. Let's go ahead and we can change the text of this second button. So we can type over here, contact us. Now it's time to display this button over here. So what we need to do, firstly go on to the settings of this first button and then after a click on the advanced tab. Now under the layout tab, here we can find an option with. So right now it is default, choose the inline auto option from this drop down. The same thing you need to do with the second button, go to the settings of this button, then advanced and then under the width, we have to select inline auto. Now make sure you must need to be having the Elementor Pro page builder, then only this setting will be available. So now here we can see both buttons are next to each other, but they are sticked. So what we can do, simply go to the settings of the first button, under the advanced, uncheck this icon and we can add right margin. So let's add some right margin. So here is a small gap in between both of these buttons. Also. Google Play and App Store buttons are stick to both of these buttons. So we can add some bottom margin as well, like 15 pixels. The same thing we can do with this button, 15 pixels. Okay, after that we can simply update this page. And let's have a look into a new tab. Here you go. So you can see both of these buttons are aligned horizontally next to each other. So I hope you get the complete idea. If this video was helpful, please subscribe, like this video. And if you want me to make a separate video on your topic, just let me know in the comment section. Till then, thank you so much and have a wonderful day.